I thought Jason with me. It's Hibachi night. What you guys say, Martha? Go ahead. What you got to say? You figure it out. What you want? Which way you going? That's how I had a Hibachi night. Oh, with me. We fake way with it. It's the purple trick. It's extra credit, too. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four. We got the, um, what's this? Yeah, here you go. We got ginger. This is real hibachi. It's like spicy mayo. We got Jose over here. I don't know who Jose is. Jose. That nigga named Jose. Y'all named Jose, bro. What's his name, Jason? Chog name. All right. Okay. Nah, nah. Keep cool. Do your thing. So we got the spring mix. Okay. With the ginger beet dressing. Okay. Tight, 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 tight. Yummy, yummy sauce. Tight, tight. For second chicken. Tight. Ginger sauce for seafood and vegetable. Okay. Any allergies? Let me know. Garlic butter. We all want garlic butter. You finna be throwing the shrimp in niggas' mouth? Huh? That's for Jason. My, he said he wants you to throw the shrimp in his mouth. That's good. <laughs> <laughs> he a He was. He was. Bro. Go ahead, dog. Sure. Why you got the camera in my face? Ask a question or something. How old is you, nigga? Old enough. Good shit. How old is old enough? Cheers. All right. We having a bait. What? Oh. Wait. Yeah, oh, that live, bro. This is about to get posted. What are you tripping? Maybe they have a child. When y'all, y'all, when y'all expect it? What? A child. They all saying what they have. When you having your? I don't know. I can't answer that question. <laughs> But I don't have nobody here to, to pressure me to ask that. It's no pressure, ask, though. Yeah, it ain't, no it ain't but I'm saying. I'm, letting, I'm asking you. I'm willing. Smart answer. That was a, that was a smart answer. <laughs> but that for God willing. You got damn right. Warm up, okay? Let's show off, okay? My second day. Don't cut yourself. Two shots after, okay? Let's, let's go, Jose. Jack Sparrow. Okay. Okay. I don't you know if I want to go Hey, Reese, where you get dog at? Turn it down. Turn it down. Turn the music down, bro. They trying to get me copyrighted. I need to make some cheese off this. Damn, Jack Sparrow. Huh? A little, a little. Yeah, that should be fine. I'll probably a little, a little bit. All right. Hey. Shot you took. Second day, second day. It's the second day. You're a bad influence, but I like you, man. You're a bad influence. My bad, man. I like you, bro. It's all good. Life is good. Life is good. Oh, you got pot stickers, okay? Yes, sir. They're chicken, okay? No, uh, no pork, okay? And then I gotta make some fried rice without pork, okay? Wait, what? <laughs> what dog mean without pork, though, bro? What if I liked it pork? Just gonna set this up.
Yeah, I know. I know. I ain't catching shit in my mouth. I'm a grown ass man, bro. No, we got you going. She's she been singing for four hours straight. Yeah, she might like the mic. She not a king no more, so that don't count. There you go. Hey, hey, give me my minutes. <laughs> Come on here and be like on those, <laughs> excuse me, some sympathy, whatever, because I really feel bad on myself of just like how everything, how I, how I ended this month. I feel very bad on that. Like, I feel like, damn, Derek, you could have did better, but it'd be hard for me to record when I'm back at home. Like, I know y'all been saying like, oh, put your family in the video, but my only person that I really want to be in the videos is my sister and my niece and nephew, but it just... Like, what we gonna do? Like, we were supposed to do a cooking thing, but she cooked, like, top-notch food. She ain't cooking no regular pizza and things like that. So, it's kind of... And I be so tired, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I gotta understand, man. I love driving to the baby because, like I said, it clears my mind. But when I get there, I'm so drained. Like, I'm, I'm like, damn, I'm just tired. So, the first time that I went... A lot of stuff was happening. Didn't have no time to film. I could have filmed it, but I'm like, you know, I just didn't feel like filming. And then I didn't film, and then I uh, ended up letting that day go by. Then my sister had a party. I got, you know, that was the footage y'all seen before. It wasn't a, couldn't do a lot because I got so drunk. Like, I got beyond drunk. Like, beyond drunk. If y'all follow me on Instagram, that's why I tell y'all to follow me on Instagram. If y'all follow me on Instagram, you would have seen I was literally passed out in my sister's room. I was tore up, like, toe up to the flow up. Drunk. So, like, I just knew, like, oh, it's a wrap. And then that next day, I felt so sick. Like, I felt beyond sick. I had things that I was going to do. I was going to do some cooking things with my sister, cooking video, or we was just going to do something with my daughter or any something. But it just didn't get to that point because I was just, I was out of it. Like, I was sleeping all day. I slept all day. Head was banging. Body was just sore. Like, it, it was a wrap. Like, because I, I was drinking like it was no tomorrow. Literally no tomorrow. Like, I was going to do, I ain't going to lie. Y'all let me know if y'all want this. I was going to have a, a deep conversation with me and my baby mama. Um, I don't like, I hate just saying my baby mama like that. But I was going to have a deep conversation with her on camera so y'all can see, like, how we are I mean we cool like me and her ain't beefing it ain't nothing crazy like it ain't like I hate my baby mama and things like that like nah we cool but I was gonna have that conversation and put it on camera for y'all like so comment below if y'all want y'all want like a we was a we was a toxic couple uh, I ain't gonna lie we was a toxic couple we was together for a long time probably about six seven she been with me for a while. She well, she was with me for a while. Um, but yeah, um, it was a very toxic. It was a very toxic situation, and I don't mind. Like I said, I like to be transparent with y'all. I feel like we family. I feel like we cool. So I wouldn't mind having like a conversation with me and her on camera. Like y'all, let me know. I was gonna do that the next day. I was thinking just different things, but my body was just not letting me 
do anything. Like I was, like I said, I was beyond drunk. I had a great time. My sister had a hibachi night. I had a dude come, as y'all seen, cook in the backyard, and it was lit. You know what I'm saying? We all was just having a good ass time. And then I think what really messed me up is I'm just drinking. Like I'm just drinking. I drunk one buzz ball. Then I'm just drinking. I'm, I'm, I'm just I'm just drinking different shots. Uh, my sister friend came over with some black tequila. Bro I, bro, I don't know why. She came with some black tequila. I drunk that. I think that's what really messed me up. And then it was this last shot I took with my little cousin E. Bro, that, that, that. Normally, it's my brother that be blacked out drunk, and we be having to pick him up off the flow and things like that but it was really all the dudes you seen in that video threw up besides my brother my brother was the most sober one which was crazy because he's normally the most turnt and if i had videos to show i think i do but i don't want he ain't gonna want me to post that so i ain't gonna post that but yeah but back to everything like i said i feel kind of like bad just because like i i, I was supposed to do the 30 days um, and I missed two days out of the 30 days. So I'm on my way back to L.A. now just because I feel like I want to come back home and work. I got to go back to the Bay this it's Friday or Saturday because uh, I'm performing at I Am Suit, I Am Summer Show. So if y'all in the Bay and y'all going to Great America and uh, or y'all buy Great America, pull up. Um, it's going to be lit. Shout out I Am Suit. Uh, well, I don't know if I'm supposed to say anything, but I'm, I'm going to be there. That's so why I'm driving back to the Bay this weekend. But I did. I just blasted back to L.A. Because I'm like, man, I feel more focused out here. I feel like, like, I ain't gonna lie. At my sister's house, I was just sleeping. And I was with my daughter and I was with my family. And we was just chilling. Like, I don't be feeling like I, I want to work. And because it be so relaxed. I think when you get around your family, you get to a point where it's just like, all right, I'm cool. Like, I'm chilling. Like, you know what I'm saying? But I really forgot my, my mission for them two days or the day and then I posted then I missed one day just don't beat me up bro just just give get cut me some slack bro like I, I literally went 28 29 days bro posting consecutive that was literally the hardest thing I'm just for that though miss me missing them two days I am giving y'all more vlogs like this doesn't mean I'm stopping I just wanted to get a groove and you know get with y'all get get some type of momentum with y'all so y'all can understand that i i want to do the youtube thing too on top of me doing music i want to do the youtube thing too so this 30 days was just to introduce that now am i gonna keep posting every day i can't i can't promise that because like i told y'all this month i'm gonna be focusing more on music and with that being said, I'm still going to do like, you know, when I drop a vlog, it's going to be entertaining, little funny things. But I am going to be equipped, like, entering more of the studio stuff, like, more of recording in the process of me building my album. Because I do want to drop an album by the end of this year. So I want to drop a body of work. So that's what I'm, another reason I'm coming back home is because I want to get my recording process going. Uh, get some more vlogs in, get some more minutes with y'all before I head back to the bay. And I know I don't have my seatbelt on. It's because I just got gas. So relax. And I'm two minutes away from my house. I understand. Y'all be yelling at me in the comments. Talking, Put your seatbelt on. You need your seatbelt. If you don't have your seatbelt on, you're going to fly out the wind. I know. Trust me. Um, but yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed these 30 days. I hope y'all enjoyed getting to know me a little more. I hope I brought some type of entertainment to y'all. Follow me on Instagram. Subscribe. We almost to 40K. We almost made it to the 40K, so I'm not done dropping. We going to make it. We at 39. Subscribe right now. I got way more ideas in the works. Um, we not done. We literally just getting started. Y'all got me really enjoying this. Like, I, I, I used to do it back then, but now, like, I really got, I'm, I'm getting that enjoyment of pressing that upload button the hitting this record button and just vlogging like that's you know it's, it's cool and then i like the attraction that it gets like i like the interaction i like how y'all be commenting on things y'all hit me in my dms or y'all you know what i'm saying like i like the interaction so make sure y'all drop a comment drop a like 
follow me on Instagram. Um, and yeah, we're gonna keep this thing going. But I just wanted to apologize though, because I didn't, I wasn't able to go the whole 30 days, like I said. But I did do some double uploads, so I hope that can count towards my, you know what I'm saying? Because I know I did at least 30 some uploads, at least 30, 31, 32. I was at like 30, 29 a couple days ago and I counted, so I know I'm probably at like 30, 31. So use them as he really did the 30 days but just understand i'm a human too at the end of the day so my head was spinning when i was after that day that i was drunk i just felt like nothing i couldn't do anything like i literally was sleep all day i wish i wish i recorded that that's what i'm finna start doing if i got some issues i'm finna just start recording my issues and showing y'all like it was bad like it was bad i haven't threw up while drinking in years well, no, not years. I say like a year, year and a half. Like when I, even when I went to Miami, I ain't throw up. I was drunk though in Miami. I was bugged though, but I ain't, I ain't throw up. Like I know how to handle my liquor, but when you with your family, you just feel more comfortable. You just be like, man, fuck it. I know, you know, I ain't gotta watch my, you know, watch my back. Not like I gotta watch my back anywhere else, but it's just like it's just more comfortable. Like I know I'm not leaving. I know I don't have to go nowhere. I'm staying here, so I'm just finna get fucked up, and that's what happened. And it was a great time. Um, I got a little bit of that that y'all seen in the beginning, but I wish I would have got more. But it just was, it just was a lit day, bro. So thank y'all for tuning in. Make sure y'all subscribe. More videos is on the way. I am back home in LA, so that means we finna go crazy. We finna go crazy. So comment what y'all want to see. Let me know. Peace.